Kang Tao, an actor, has announced that he will join the military on September 20th. Kang Tao, you did well. Kang Tao, best known for his role in Extraordinary Attorney Wu, has announced that he will join the military on September 20th. Kang Tao shared the sad news with his fans during his fan meeting TikTok Stage Connect, Sui Tao, revealing he would be enlisting in the military on September 20th. The message was delivered to me. I was summoned to do my duty to my country. On September 20th, I will enlist in the military. As a thank you to my fans who will be waiting for me, I will sing Kim Dong Ril's song Thank You. Thank you for creating such wonderful memories for me. I will return with a positive attitude. Oh, Kang Tae Kang Tae Oh held a two hour fan meeting on TikTok, chatting with fans and performing songs for them. His release date is set for March 2024. Finally, the Ministry of National Defense decides not to conduct a public survey on military service exemption for BTS. South Korea's Ministry of National Defense has issued an official statement announcing its decision to conduct a public survey to determine whether BTS should be exempt from military service. The ministry stated on September 1st, the ministry has decided against conducting a public survey on the issue of BTS military service exemption. The media is currently reporting on the matter as if this survey will directly influence the ministry's decision on whether or not BTS members should receive mandatory service exemption. The ministry wishes to emphasize that the outcome of such, a serious issue will not be determined solely by the results of a public survey. Previously, during a meeting of the National Defense Committee, Assemblyman Sulhoon claimed, we must conduct a public survey as soon as possible to determine the public's opinion on this matter. The people own this country, and they have complete control over it. It is also critical to assess public opinion on the issue of mandatory military service exemption for BTS. Following the Assemblyman's claims, the National Assembly was chastised for putting off their responsibilities to the public.